Hello, welcome to the show. This is going to be a short one today. I'm on my way into Tumbleweed with a cougar and a couple birds. I get gunned down. Nothing new there, right? Would have gone a little better for me had I had Slippery Bastard already equipped, but I had Painted Black equipped. I don't even remember why. That's okay, though. If they kill me, I come back and kill them over and over Time for another episode of the Revenge of the Slippery Bastard. At this point, I don't even care about the cougar on the birds on my horse. Because quite frankly, the butcher's not going to talk to me. I'm going to go up to him, and it's going to all be grayed out. So at this point, what's the point in even trying? I'm just going to wreck these fools. Looks like they're posse up. Looks like a posse of three. But by the end of the episode, they're going to be down to one. I don't know if the other two guys parlay, or if they just leave the server. It gets down to just a 1v1, where there's only one red dot. I kill him a couple times, and then I just bounce out. These guys are such scrubs, they're hardly even worth my ammo. I only die one more time here. And I think it's to a fourth person. I don't think it's to any of these original three. There's a fourth guy, he's tackling one of the three that I'm fighting, and while he's tackling them, I shoot the guy that he's tackling, and my explosive ammo, the area of effect, hits the guy that's tackled him, which turns him red, and then I think he shoots me in the back as I'm turning and walk, walking away from him. And then we both, you know, I spawn in, and I see that he's close to me, so I don't know, maybe he didn't kill me, maybe he did, I don't know. But at that point, he's a red dot on the radar, and I do kill him again. Well, I guess for the first time I killed him at that point. Which I didn't actually... I would not have done so had I realized it was him, but I pulled the trigger at the same instant that I was realizing. So sorry, dude. I didn't mean to kill you. I know we're in a fight here. Trying to teach these griefers a lesson. Anyway, though, I'm like, these guys suck so much. I'm like totally potatoing it up. I'm caught in a crack. I can't do anything. And they just can't even hit me. I'm, like, I should have totally died there. Any decent player would have managed to kill me at that point. Oh, there's the guy right here. This is what I was talking about. See, he tackles this guy and I shoot him, and the area of effect hits him as well. And there's nobody else close enough on my radar, really shoot me at that point so I think it was him however we both spawn in kind of at the same time so then it makes me wonder like well if it was him that killed me how did he die too so maybe it was somebody out of range shooting us I don't know what happened there I, I respawned too fast to see who killed me so there's no way I can actually determine precisely what happened anyway it doesn't really matter it's just a game it's not like I heard him in real life Moving on. Back into this. Get some more revenge. It's going to be a short episode. We don't have a lot of footage of this. Just like I said, I bounced out early. You see there's three of them on the radar right now. One of them is using the mission NPC, the ghost. I'm walking in and out of being ghosted. Which I'll turn the table on them and use that in a moment. Because, my, as you can see, my dead eye core is very low. I could use a little stranger danger protection you know walk into that safe area eat some grub get my core back up and then step back out and shoot them up so now I shoot that guy nope but, but watch though like the, there's a dead person on the outside of my radar All right, okay there's two dead people there's two enemies on the outer edge of my radar right now. So I'm going to eat some food, and I'm going to step back out. Now, now, see, there's only one. Two of the guys turned pink. So maybe they're not posse up, but then how did all three of them turn red earlier? I don't know. I, I swear this game is kind of funny sometimes when it comes to marking enemies. Those guys should be red too, I think. I don't know. But I can only see this after looking back at the footage while I was actually in-game. It struck me that I was down to a 1v1 at this point, 
and a 1v1, I just didn't even want to bother anymore. A 3v1, I was having fun, because that's, you know, a little more challenging. That 1v1, that's just too easy. Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you taking a view. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Catch you next time.